Hi, welcome to a week in the life of a Mormon, aka LDS. If you don't know what LDS is, it means Latter-day Saints, which is part of the full name of our church. We don't actually go by Mormons. We go by members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, or for short, you can say LDS. Seminary is a class most LDS high school students take. In this class, we learn about the Bible, God, and much more. On Wednesdays, we do the same thing as Monday and Tuesday, except we have a church activity with our church. <laughs> We're currently on our way to Wednesday's activity. Um, today's activity is uh, painting and chatting. Okay, so these are the twins. We're all part of Santa Clara Fort Ward, and this is our group. And right now we're setting up the paint. We're finally doing the painting activity that Juliet has been patiently waiting for. We're going to be painting this. Uh-uh. <laughs> so this is what we're painting. Yeah. <laughs> this is what we're painting. On Thursday and Friday, we do the same thing as Monday and Tuesday. Saturday we usually have nothing going on but once every about two months we have a Mormon dance. All we do on Sunday is go to church. Hi, Jacob. Hello there. Um, are you Mormon or non-Mormon? I am a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Okay. So, do you go to seminary? Yes. Yes. Most mornings, unless I'm too tired. Okay. What time is seminary? Seven o'clock. What is seminary? It's when uh, members of the church uh, go early in the morning. We get taught and we learn about the gospel with other other church members. Good job. <laughs> hey, what's your name? Lucy. Are you Mormon or non-Mormon? Non-Mormon. Mm -hmm. What is a stake? meat. <laughs> so what is a stake? A stake? A stake is a group of a part of a city depending on the size of what town or city you live in. It could be large or small. It's a group of wards which are made up of uh, people which yeah, dist in different districts all over town. Yeah. That's your name. Yeah. Zach McEwen. <laughs> are you Mormon or non-Mormon? Non-Mormon. Do you know what a temple is? I do not know what a temple is. What do you think a temple is? Um, a big temple. <laughs> Am I here with? Uh, Ryan Ferguson. Are you Mormon? Yes. Well, not really. I guess you would say member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. So, what is the point of a temple? Uh, I guess kind of a place to do special ordinances that a normal church uh, isn't really it, the environment is, I guess, a lot more holier in a way, a lot more, um, I guess, chill. So if I wasn't LDS, would I be allowed to go into the temple? Uh, yes, on certain occasions you can, I believe. 
Is it a center? No. 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 What is baptisms for the dead? Um, I guess you go to a temple and you're baptized for uh, and on like behalf of someone who's dead who can't actually get baptized now and we believe that they can maybe uh, accept it if they would like to in heaven or wherever they are. So you don't actually baptize dead bodies? No. Hi, who am I here with? Uh, Adam Reed. Are you Mormon? Uh, yes, but uh, we go by the members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Who is the prophet? Uh, Sir uh, President Russell M. Nelson. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Eva. Um, are you Mormon or non-Mormon? Non-Mormon. Okay, do you think it's odd that we're not allowed to drink alcohol and caffeine? I mean, well, as coffee. Coffee? As a person who drinks a lot of coffee and a lot of coffee and I literally just finished my sentence, I can't, I think I understand it because it is like a pure, a purity of blood or purity of like life. Um, Cause like it does take, it is a part of like such a deep tradition of it. I feel like it's hard to break from it. I think it is weird, but it's also, I understand it because I have, a, I have a lot of family friends that are Mormon and like, which I never really under, I don't under, I, I can't say that I understand it because I wasn't, I'm not a part of it. So I don't know like the whole reasoning behind it, nor the like, why, like why, how seriously people take it. So um, I think from an outsider's perspective, I think it is weird, but I feel like it's kind of just the type of thing that when you're, it makes more sense when you're a part of it. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Hi, who am I here with? Uh, I'm Christian Bonham. <laughs> um, are you Mormon? No, I'm a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. So, I heard you don't drink coffee, is that true? Yes. Why? We believe in keeping our bodies healthy and free from addiction or substances that might harm our mind or body. Oh, perfect, perfect. Hi. Hi. What's your name? My name's Ian. Nice to meet you. Um, okay, are you Mormon or not Mormon? Non-Mormon. What are some stereotypes that you've heard about Mormons? Um, that they're always very, very too kind. And, you know, that they're not like other Christians. Mm -hmm. Have you heard any bad stereotypes about Mormons? Um, not that I'm aware of. I've only ever heard good stereotypes. Okay, that's good. Also different. It's also very different because I feel like Mormonism is, more, is not only a religion, but also kind of like a... It's. I feel like it's more. I don't want to say culty. It's not. It's not a cult. It's, I, it's a stereotype to be kind of like a cult. But it's. I don't know. It's just more of like a way of life, also, because like there are like caffeine, like like not allowed to drink caffeine, not allowed to like alcohol. Like it's the your own like personal like. Oh. What's your name? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> okay, what's your name? Zach McEwen. Dude, louder. Why? <laughs> do both girls and guys both can go at 18? Or just guys? Well, you, well just. You, you just told me both. <laughs> no. Girls actually only can go at 19. They Why do women hate women? <laughs> Why do they hate women? Women. <laughs> Victoria, do you want to come in? No. <laughs> okay, got it. Um, what do you think soaking is? Well, soaking is like, when you like get in the bath, you like in the water, you know? Like, yeah, and you turn into a raisin. A raisin? <laughs>